Good evening. Thank you all for coming out for a historic and special moment in Oak Creek Franklin history. The uh, beginning of our next elementary school that you as a community supported and will continue to support from the dirt to the foundations to the walls. So I appreciate you all being here. We have a lot of guests that we'll introduce a little bit later during the, the ground breaking ceremonial groundbreaking part. Uh, we have representatives here from the school board in the city and Northwest Mutual and Epstein Newer Architects and DGS Construction and some of our future students. And we're gonna hear from a few of these stakeholders who helped make this happen because none of this happens with a lot of people working together. And that's the most wonderful thing of all. <laughs> so I'm gonna start by introducing uh, our school board president, Mr. Frank Carini, please welcome him. Thank you. First of all, from as a board, as an overall, we'd like to thank Thank you for, to everyone in the community who has supported this project. The building of a new elementary school will greatly benefit all the elementary age children in our district by significantly reducing our class sizes and thus improving student learning. Our district population has been growing continuously and this new school will allow room for further growth and development in our community. Finally, I want to say thank you for all, all of you who, have, who are here this evening for this groundbreaking ceremony. This is a great time, an exciting time for our school district as a board and for our community. And we look forward to seeing the completion of this new elementary school and all the positive changes associated with it. Finally, as a parent of the students in our district and as board member, the board overall is grateful for our continued support. We thank you very much. So this school came into being partly because there was a three-way agreement between actually lots of people the county and the city and Northwest Mutual this was a four-party agreement ultimately it was a very complicated agreement with lots of people and uh, one of the key players was the city of Oak Creek and so we invited our mayor Steve Scafidi to say a few words on this occasion building schools is always a very cool thing and today is no different we got a gorgeous Wisconsin summer day, even though it's getting to the end of summer. Uh, the superintendent's right, this didn't happen without a lot of cooperation. We had an outstanding council in place, they do the heavy lifting. Uh, we're represented here by Alderman Dan McKavich in the green shirt, Alderman uh, Guzikowski back there with the suit on taking a picture, and then Alderman Ken Gale's up here. We also have the city clerk, Captain Risky, Director of Celebrations Commission, Carolyn McKavich. All these people understood why this was important and why this, this partnership had to happen. We needed, we needed room for that 7th elementary school. We needed room for that freshman campus. The city had some, some uh, space needs that we needed to do for development. Working together in a long, hard uh, process got this done. So it's, it's my great pleasure to be here today. I think this is going to be a shining example of what cooperation between the school district and the city can be all about. So happy to see this happen today. It's a wonderful day for Oak Creek. And I'm glad you guys are all here. Thank you. Next, representing uh, Northwest Mutual Life Insurance, whose building we have a nice view of right across the hill there, and who this property used to belong to is Catherine Young. I'm delighted to be here today. I began working on this project almost 10 years ago and never imagined it would lead to this very special event. Uh, when the county asked Northwestern Mutual for help to expand Falk Park, and to protect the environmentally significant Ashhanadal Woods across the street. We saw it as an opportunity to make a contribution and make something great happen here in the neighborhood of our Franklin campus. Our discussions with the county ultimately led to discussions with the city, and in 2010, a unique partnership was formed between Oak Creek, Milwaukee County, and Northwestern Mutual. At the time, Mayor Bolander had the foresight to see that participating in transactions like this could support growth in the community by welcoming a mix of uses, including community, residential, retail, and, and uh, office, while still preserving and growing existing parkland. That participation led to the city's acquisition of this site from the county for community purposes, and Mayor Scafidi has cultivated the community growth that led to this first new elementary school in 10 years, I believe. Northwestern Mutual is very pleased that our newest neighbor is a school, because education is important to us as a company, and we're com that commitment means that we like to expend our time and energy and talent in those regards. Um, our employees are involved in mentoring 
programs that help children improve their reading skills. And these programs take place both at our campuses, both here at Franklin and in Milwaukee, and in three school districts that we currently support, or schools that we support in the areas of Amani, Metcalf Park, and Muskego Way. We also recently gave a total of $1.7 million to support educational programs in the Milwaukee area, and we continue to look for more ways to help in other communities. We think building this school on this land is a great decision. Congratulations on taking this important step forward, and on behalf of Northwestern Mutual Colleagues, Senator, thank you for letting us be a part of this very special day. So we sort of heard from the one side, the planning and making it happen, and now we're going to hear from the people that will actually live here and work here and learn here. So I'm going to introduce uh, the principal of this school, Mr. Ed Mittag, and he's going to introduce Elliot and Brody, who we believe will be students here, and we're going to hear what they have to say about their looking forward to coming to school here when it becomes more than dirt. So Mr. Mittag, let's meet our students. Thank you, Dr. Culver. And as you can tell, there's been a change in the program. The most important people get to talk at the end, and that's the, the students here. I want to thank every, all of you for attending our special groundbreaking ceremony, and thank you for giving me the opportunity to be the principal at elementary school number seven. Really, today is a day to celebrate. Our community is getting what they so need and deserve, a new elementary school. There are many individuals, groups, and organizations to thank. I want to thank the uh, Future Facilities Planning Committee. This group consisted of parents, teachers, administrators, community members, representatives from VJS and uh, EU who began meeting in early 2014 and made the recommendation to the Oak Creek Franklin School Board to go forward with a referendum for a new elementary and secondary school. I want to thank the Oak Creek Franklin School Board, former school superintendent Dr. Burmeister, and Oak Creek Franklin School Superintendent Dr. Culver the team from EU, the architects, our construction team from VJS, the core design team, which is a group of teachers from all grade levels and from all elementary schools and principals, whose role was to help in developing the best learning environment for our students. Thank you to Northwestern Mutual Life, the city of Oak Creek, and this, really the citizens of Oak Creek Franklin School District. I thank each of you for your support. Uh, we could not be here today with all of the people that I just listed. This is a big reminder of what a supportive community that we have here in Oak Creek and Franklin. This school building will be something that the entire Oak Creek Franklin community will be proud of. It will be exciting for all of us to watch the building of this school in the next year. Thank you again for being here and for your support of the students and schools in Oak Creek Franklin. Thank you. Okay, then I'm going to turn it over. Um, these are two current third graders um, at Cedar Hills. And again, they, uh, they could be new students here um, at the new school. So I'm going to have Brody start, and then uh, we'll turn it over to Elliot. Hi, my name is Brody Duncan, and I am eight years old. I am going to third grade at Cedar Hills this year. Next year, I'll be attending fourth grade at this school, new school. I hope that the kids that get to go to the new school are happy and excited. I also hope that the kids going here learn a lot. I am excited that I can watch the school every single day. Hi, thank you all for coming. My name is Ellie. Now we're gonna start off with a joke. Knock, knock. Who's there? Orange. Orange you. Orange you glad we're building a new school. <laughs> <laughs> I will be in third grade this year at Cedar Hills. I love Cedar Hills. It is where my mom and my uncles went to school. But a new school is exciting. I am lucky that I get to see the progress of the new school on the construction site because I live so close. I am so happy that Mr. Mateg is going to be the new principal at the new school. He is the best. I sure hope Mr. Mateg can make a half court shot in the new gym. <laughs>
That's why we let students speak last. <laughs> so we, um, for the ceremonial groundbreaking, we sort of invited representatives of the different stakeholder groups. And so I'll sort of go through the, and there's more of you out there that are part of these groups, but these sort of represent all of us in different ways. So um, when I call your name, why don't you grab your hat, put it on, and someone will give you a shovel over there. These two gentlemen over here will give you a shovel and then start lining up across our symbolic dirt here. So let's go in reverse order. Our stakeholder student representatives, Elliot and Brody, why don't you get your hat and put your shovel and then line up over here. Uh, representing the school board tonight, we have Mr. Frank Carini, Mr. John Jossert, uh, Mr. Verhalen couldn't be present tonight, Kathleen Borchert, and Ms. Cheryl Cerniglia. So they're going to join us. Representing the state, uh, we're lucky tonight to have a, a state representative here, Representative Jesse Rodriguez, whose son starts kindergarten tomorrow. And where she lives might have a child go to this school. Thank you, Mrs. Rod Representative Rodriguez. Uh, representing the city of Oak Creek, we have uh, Mayor Steve Scafidi and Council President Kim Gell. I know we have some other older people here. Representing Epstein Ewer Architect, we have Eric Dilfek. Representing, uh, how many schools have you designed in Oak Creek, would you say? Five schools, it's their fifth school in this. VJS Construction, represented by Chief Operating Officer Chad Bathke and Senior Project Manager, Manager Chris Coggins. How many schools have you built in Oak Creek? Five. Got a roll going. Representing Northwest Mutual Life Insurance, Catherine Young, Real Estate Counsel Frank Shaw, Assistant General Counsel, and Susan Callahan, who is the Director of Governmental Relations, are going to join us up here. And last but not least, representing the administration is Principal Ed Mittag. Business Manager, Executive Director of Business, Kathy Kramer, who does a huge amount of work on this, and myself. Count down, okay? So like one, two, three, and then we'll, we'll turn over and you can take a picture. Okay? That's counting, right? Uh, we're gonna take a turn and sort of toss it in front. All right. Don't toss it to me. Not at each other. Who's counting? Yeah, you guys count out there. One, two. Three!